Jay Fairfield, Commanding Officer, Recruiting Station Frederick. Major Collins is now delivering the colors to the commanding officer. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the transferring of the colors. From Commandant of the Marine Corps to Major Evan J. Fairfield, effective 10 hundred 25 June 2021. You stand relieved of your duties as a commanding officer, recruiting station Frederick, and are directed to report to Debt One Technical Services Company, Western Virginia. Signed, David H. Berger, General, Commandant of the Marine Corps. From Commandant of the Marine Corps to Major Daniel P. Chamberlain, effective 1001, 25 June 2021. You are directed to report to the commanding officer, 4th Marine Corps District, for duty as a commanding officer. Recruiting Station Frederick, 4th Marine Corps District, Eastern Recruiting Region. Signed, David H. Berger, General, Commandant of the Marine Corps. Ladies and gentlemen, please be seated. The President of the United States takes pleasure in presenting the Meritorious Service Medal with Gold Star in lieu of second award to Major Evan J. Fairfield, United States Marine Corps, for his service as set forth in the following citation. For outstanding meritorious achievement while serving as a commanding officer of Recruiting Station Frederick, 4th Marine Corps District from June 2019 to June 2021. During this period, Major Marine Corps, the United States Naval Service. For the President, Julie Nethercott, Brigadier General, U.S. Marine Corps, Commanding General, U.S. Marine, uh, Marine Corps Recruit Depot, Paris Island, Eastern Recruiting Region. For all they invested, and your excess in the families of the recruiting station. We wish you and Tejel fair winds and following seas. Sincerely, Julie L. Nethercott, Brigadier General, U.S. Marine Corps, Commanding General, Marine Corps Recruit Depot, Eastern Recruiting Region, Paris Island, South Carolina. Willing to sit there and do the four hours of TCs because they needed help or out there grabbing you know, a pile of, of, of business cards to help them AC to get the contacts that they needed so that they could em embark on this most important mission. So leadership by the example, through not only you, through your Sergeant Major, through your RI, it, it just exudes throughout the whole command and your support to the Marines on this most important mission. For your bar of excellence and, and that whole mentality that you possess, but I know you got to big shoes to fill, um, I'm confident, and so are all these Marines behind you, that you have a great team that you are stepping into, uh, you know, that sets it from the EXO, the SART Major, the RI, and all the Marines across this, that they're going to continue to strive and maintain that excellence. Um, Evans, you know, this command has accomplished quite a few things that you've heard some of. But, uh, you know, as I, as I thought through it, it really, you know, everything that just uh, the, the Colonel read off in, in the citation, it belongs to all of the Marines and the recruiters. Uh, sitting in the, in the back of this room here. Um, I don't own any of that. I have learned more from you than I'm, I'm, than I'm sure that you've learned from me while I've been out here, whether it's uh, sitting down with, with Gunny Ishak on one of my first station visits, and I'm there to, to, to train him uh, as my first year CEO, and he's actually uh, training me, showing me how to find things in the crib, so we're going out to a second year recruiter who teaches me how to awkwardly talk to people in, uh, in Walmart at uh, 9 o'clock at night, telling me that you're all successful. Um, for my, my peers sitting here and those that can't be, I, I appreciate everything you all have done too. The group chat gets pretty spicy sometimes, but it's always a uh, good deal to have a sounding board uh, and, and have kind of block shields and, and come up with uh, collective solutions for some pretty complex problems that we've worked through uh, over the past couple of years. Uh, and then, you know, last last but not least, I see you all sitting there and are all 10 of you more or less, but uh, station commanders. You are the other room to the fellow RSCOs. Thank you for uh, the initial guidance and the input you gave me over the last few days. It's been a very warm welcome. I appreciate uh, the uh, advice that you've given me, and I'm looking forward to working with each and every one of you uh, over the next year or so. <coughs>
Sergeant Major, and the command team here at Fighting Frederick, thank you for all that you've done for me over the last year or so. Uh, I found out in August last year I was going to come here, and you all just started to reach out between you and Mass Sergeant McNew. Uh, I really do appreciate the time you put in with, to me and helping me out along the way. Uh, Evan, uh, since August of last year, we've had at least 20 different Zoom conferences, and uh, you've spent at least two to three weeks uh, cumulatively with me. Uh, I just want to thank you and Tejal uh, for opening up your household to me uh, and Jess. Um, I didn't just have a, a brother in arms, but I've got friends and family for life here. So thank you for that very much. And uh, thank you again to the Marines and the Color Guard and to the working party that's been out here for the last few days. You put a lot of time in. we got Marines up here for PAR. Uh, so they're going to class, and then they were coming out here to actually set this up and get this done. So thank you again.